There is no pitcher before it is lit. Hello, my name is Axel Hansen. I am the Viking Gaffer. Today's lesson is, what is lighting involved? You light for visibility, depth, mood, and directing where the audience should look. Knowing the shot and the script, what are you lighting and why? What is important for the audience to see and not see? How should the audience feel? What is the mood? Where on screen or photograph do they need to look? Understanding this allows you to start planning for the lighting. To plan, you need to know the camera angle. How will the camera see the actor, action or object? From the front, back or side, low or high, square or slanted. What lens will be used for the shot, wide or tight? Know your subject. Where will they be in frame? Will the actor be sitting or standing, running or walking? Is the object big or small, shiny or dull? What will they be wearing? Is the actor wearing a hat, mask, dark or light clothing? This determines what lights you will use and where you will place them. Make a light plot. You need to know where you will place the lighting equipment on the set or location to achieve the lighting. How will you direct the light in relation to your subject and camera angle? What equipment do you have or must you get? Execute your plan on the day. Have solutions ready to make potential compromises to the lighting due to unforeseen circumstances. Request the moving of the actors, objects, or camera angle so it works for the lighting you have set up. Whichever is the best for the script is the solution you should do or suggest. So that is what lighting involves. Know the script. Know the camera angle. Know your subject. Make a lighting plot. Execute the lighting plot. Have solutions on the day should problems arise while shooting. Well, I hope this gives you an idea of what lighting involves and some guidelines to follow in achieving it in your shoot. If you have any questions, please feel free to ask in the comment sections below. I will answer them to the best of my knowledge. If you would like to see more lessons, please subscribe by clicking below. Good light and good luck. See you on the next lesson where we cover the aims of lighting. Remember, there is no picture before it is lit.